Welcome to the Car Craze Full Garage, and this is a special episode where I thought I would show you a little bit of insight into the racing of Caterham's. Today we are at Silverstone, the home of British motorsport, for the final round of the 2017 Caterham Championship. Now I'm racing in a 420R, it's the fastest one in the series. It runs a 2 litre Duratec with a sequential box, and the racing is so tight and competitive, it's epic. Let's hope you enjoy some of these insights. So quality this morning was all right. It's always a bit of a strategy with these tires. The tires we've got, you've got about three, four laps in them. You've got an out lap, maybe one more out lap, and then you've got your flying lap. And after that, they start to drop off. So actually I managed the, the least number of laps of anyone out there today. Only did four laps in my quali, uh, which is pretty damn low. Maybe I could have stayed out a little bit longer, but uh, it's that gamble. And if you keep going, actually, are you gonna get any quicker? Because the tires themselves aren't getting any quicker. Um, so I took that, that shot. When I came in, I was P5, uh, ended up P8. I'm not unhappy with that, that's all right. It's a good place to start. It's the back of the front pack. Uh, as long as I can stay with those guys in the race, we're on for a good one. And also with the cage as well, especially here at Silverstone where you've got the hanger straight, it's all about the toe. Uh, there's so much in the, the toe down the straights. If you get one car in front of you, it, it, it adds, takes off tenths of your lap time. If you get two or three cars in front of you, the lap times just come tumbling down. The car's mega. Uh, DPR has always done an awesome job. Uh, Lee, who looks after my car, has got it absolutely uh, spot on. We spent some time yesterday in testing, fiddling around with setups, just a few things, got it feeling nice, and now it's on a new set of tyres. It should be awesome in the race, so yeah, looking forward to getting on it. Just finished quali, uh, finished P2, which is uh, mega. Strategy for the race, uh, get out behind Lee Wiggins as best I can, uh, hold on to him, and try and break the toe. So try and get rid of everybody behind us, and. Uh, and then last five laps or so, really have a go at him.
absolutely nuts. It's so intense. Um, can't wait to go through the day to dad. It's going to give me a bit of a hard time, I think, about the last few laps. But it was so cool. Loved it. Good Good one So day two, uh, second race starts in a few hours time, but that means I've got a little bit of time to do a walk around of the car. So this is my Caterham 420R. Every car in the series, in the championship, is the same. And that's the great thing about Caterham racing, is that all the cars are the same spec, which means that it is all about the driver. There's a few tweaks you can do to set up, so a camber and uh, tow in and tow out, but otherwise there's not a lot you can do to the cars. Um, it's running the two litre four Girotech engine, the Sagev, uh, sequential box. Um, the only other thing that's sort of custom to me is the seat is moulded, um, otherwise it is an epic little car. Um, just awesome to race, real close racing. You get a lot of drafting, so there's a tow effect down the straights, which means it keeps the racing close all the time and it works out really well. That brings us to the end of this special edition of the Car Craze Full Garage. It's the final catering race weekend of the year and it's all over. Onward to next year. Please like, subscribe and there's more films coming where this one's come from. <laughs>